welcome, it's Jelly Cube. I'm here on the Sunshine Coast in Queensland, Australia, working with these lovely colours today, which are Wicca, Purple, Dark Sea, Tahiti, Cool Red, and my gorgeous Boring Medium Radio. I mixed, the mixed is the 70% of my pouring medium with 30% water added to it and then I just add it to the paint as previously described um, until the paint is the correct consistency for a particular pour so I have all the info in the drop down box underneath my video or there is a link to the video on um, mixing your paints but anyway, I'm pretty excited about this. I've got a nice 30 by 60 canvas and I thought I would try a reflection swipe firstly with these colors and see how I go. And if I really like them, then I'm going to try and do a chaos blow with them. But we'll see how we go first just with the um, reflection swipe. So I don't think I've just done reflection swipe without balloon kissing it for quite a long time. So we'll give it a go, even if I end up, you know, putting my little kisses on it. It's all good. That's a gooby bit. Doesn't matter. That can go out. And then I'm just going to spread this with my offset spatula, which is actually a cake icing tool that you can buy from any homeware stores. But... If you look below in the drop down box, I have got a link to my Amazon. Um, uh, what do they call them? Shopfront Amazon there. So anything you do buy from that or if you go on Amazon from my link to buy anything else, a washing machine or anything, it doesn't cost you anymore, but it always helps the creator uh, by getting a little bit of commission at no extra cost from you so that's always a way to help your creator if even if you're thinking of buying something from Amazon go on to my Amazon link below <laughs> um, will cost you no more whatever you order all your Christmas gifts or whatever um, paints but then me the creator will get a little bit of commission off Amazon and trust me it's, it's not that much but it all helps to um, it all helps, doesn't it? Rightio. So, I've got a nice base layer on there. I don't know why I was getting chunky bits in this paint. Maybe I need to thin it down slightly. So, I'm going to have a go with these colours in just a reflection swipe. So, I'm putting down the Tahiti first. Just hopefully a nice thin line. Hopefully it will look like a, a reflection, like a city skyline reflection, maybe. <laughs> Let's just hope for the best. So this is my dark sea. Oops. And I think I'll go my wicker. Wicker, wicker. I might do that both sides. And I'm going to go my cool red. And followed by my purple, purple, purple. I might do that both sides too. Hmm. I'm just going to see if I don't actually put anything else but swipe it like this. It's got no silicone in and no flow troll in these paints. They're only mixed with my pouring medium. But let's just give it a go. So I'm going to use a um, soft plastic. It's from a soft plastic file divider. I cut them up to use as my swipe tools. So let's give this a go. See, see, see. It's a reflection swipe. 
we certainly probably don't want any cells it's nice to not have cells in a reflection swipe just the nice colors coming through which is perfect here Is this trousers. I'm going to turn this all the way around. Just uh, wipe off your swipey tool in between each swipe so that it doesn't send your paints muddy when you swipe back over them. I well, probably would have been better off doing this on a bigger canvas to actually leave some negative space both sides. So I think that would have worked better. But you could certainly, when this is dried off, do a city skyline in there so it looks as though it's reflecting night sky over water. Ooh, that's pretty, pretty, pretty. But yeah, I think I could have done with doing it on a larger canvas to leave more um, negative space. I'll give it a whiz over with my heat one. That's very pretty and it's actually lovely to have something that's not um, cells for a reflection swipe so I'm thinking that I'm going to let this dry up and decide whether I want to do my city buildings on it maybe in like a black silhouette or something and see how that works so we might um, just let that one dry off but it's quite pretty all on its own. These paintings certainly like this do sell well. Um, what I'm thinking I should have done is maybe do it offset. But if you want to do a city skyline then you need to have it set more like that on a horizontal. But I will have a think about that one. I really quite like it. But of course the balloon lady in me really wants to give it a balloon. But I'm thinking, maybe not, maybe not. I will have a think about this one and come back to it. I'll, um, it's really pretty and beautiful colours. Okay. I've decided I'm going to do some of my puddles in here and do a chaos bloom in a few of the areas with the same colours that I'm using, that I've used. So I'll just do... This is really very, very thick. So I'm just thinking I want to just add a few kind of botanical effects in here. So I'm going to. I'm going to see what we get. Back to the Tahiti, Tahiti. I might completely mess it up, but I'm gonna try it. I just want to um, see what I can get out of this. Go back to the purple. Just add a bit more of that wicker, I really like that, oops, and we'll see how it looks like with a um, blown out 
See if I can get a botanical effect on it. Give it a go over with my heat one. Colours. Colours are absolutely stunning actually. I'll just pour a bit of this white on. Oh, they look like fried eggs. Get me a little wonder blower. Okay, let's give this a go. Um, this a bit because it's so bright and colourful I do love it but it's kind of um, I know I need to do some embellishing or just some uh, little edits to it you've got to make it your own remember your art your rules your way wow it, the colors are stunning really happy with the colors Just, just a cheeky, cheeky little one in the centre to give it some oomph, I'm thinking. <gasps> yes, that's what's messing. Let's wipe this off in between. Otherwise it gets muddy. Just in the centre. I'll leave that to dry a bit, but that is like really in your face colourful kind of created a botanical effect but uh, I'm kind of losing the shape of sort of uh, a blossom or leaf, uh, you know the flower blossom but it absolutely colours are beautiful and I don't know that's growing on me more and more now, growing on me more and more, I like it. Okay guys what do you think? It was a bit crazy wasn't it? Um, doing that reflection swipe or would you have left it just as the reflection swipe it's personal choice isn't it but I'm really happy with those colors and I've got uh, lots of that color left so I'm going to go on to another one now uh, maybe mixing up a bit doing a different style so my lovelies please take care hope you enjoyed this little bit of fun little bit of trial and error, error, error. So let the drying gods be with me, which I think they absolutely be fine with this one. And I'll be back tomorrow thinking of another crazy idea. Okay, bye for now.